Hey, this is John, and this is my adjustable spark gap. In the past, I've used a couple wires just taped to a table, but I wanted to do something more precise, and I didn't just want to use a couple bolts that were twisted closely together, because I didn't want there to be sharp edges where there could be leakage, and I also wanted to be able to adjust it while it was running. As you can see, it's mostly made of wood, and on this side I have an adjustable base, which has a bolt mechanism uh, I can turn to precisely adjust the spark gap distance. And on this side, the base is fixed, but the rod is allowed to slide, and I have uh, this rubber band which allows it to reset to the original position. Okay, so the rods are quarter inch aluminum, which I've used a grinder and sandpaper to smooth out the ends, and they're just clamped on with zip ties, so they could easily be replaced with another type of material or a thicker rod. Uh, and the wood is all three quarter inch maple. So that's the basic setup. Um, be sure to check out my next video where I talk about the effect of airflow and a magnetic field over the spark gap.